Hello internet friends, welcome to my channel and to another day of attempting cinematic vlogging. Please excuse the close proximity. Uh, to ensure that my camera doesn't get messed up by water, you're under the umbrella with me. All right, so on to today's plan. There is no plan. I have no idea what I'm gonna be filming. I just know that I need to catch a bus. The bus comes every hour, so we're on the way to catch that bus. Right now I have two ideas floating around. One is attempting downtown in the rain, since there is more rain, but it's supposed to lighten up, and I don't know if I wanna go through that disappointment again yet. And the other one is trying to capture inner turmoil symbolically down at the beach, while trying to get like a time lapse of the waves and the clouds and the rain and then past that I don't know. <laughs> Neither idea is really seeming like something I want to do. I'm starting to run out of ideas guys. And then the other thing is is that I'm not really feeling inner turmoil today. <laughs> I uh, I think I need to call my doctor at this point because I'm noticing a trend where like once a month for maybe one or two days I'll get really depressed like mad at having to be awake sort of depressed and then i'll wake up the next day completely fine like not like it never happened <laughs> is that normal i don't know so i think i probably should call just to check and make sure and if you guys are wondering why i'm sharing that uh yes this is a cinematic vlog journey but also my entire channel is all about vlogging me trying to be working on myself and getting to a happier healthier me overall I do have concerns about it just because the last time I sought a therapist from their practice, that therapist would always be like 10 minutes late, immediately let me know that he's running behind and he doesn't have much time, even though it's supposed to be a 30 minute session. And then after being 10 minutes late, would leave 10 minutes early. So I'd get 10 minutes of him spouting live, laugh, love lines to me. And I even told him something like deeply traumatizing and personal and he brushed it off completely like oh okay and I was like okay what <laughs> so if you guys have been wondering why I've been putting off therapy even though maybe some of you have been screaming at your screen saying hey girl you need to go check in on that that that's a little bit of why but I do have complete faith in my primary care doctor after I broke my leg she recommended me to go on an antidepressant because the brain's trauma response at the six month mark kind of needs resetting with it sometimes and she was dead on it, I had to be on it for a little bit it reset and it was all good <laughs> and I don't know, maybe it's all these excessive hormones now that are messing with me where it's once a month I'm getting a little too much for me to handle. Oh my gosh, I've been talking about this for so much. Uh, but that's where we're at. I'm gonna call her and see if she can't help me or at least recommend a different therapist. And I'm gonna have to be open and honest with her about why I don't want him. And that's also scary because I don't want to be the person who complains at a doctor's office about other doctors in their office. But I also need to advocate for myself. So I'll do that. Maybe I can think of something today to represent the nerves I feel. I do feel a little nervous about all of it, but I'm, I don't feel I don't feel especially depressed about it, you know? Anxiety, not depression. So yeah, I'll give it a thought and let you guys know what I come up with. Let's find out. So I have decided to go to Squalicum Park Beach and film the rain and the clouds and the waves. And just the beach in general is always like an easy filming day. I am concerned that I don't know where I'm going. Crap. I probably should put this away and try and find the directions again just to make sure. It said six minutes, but I'm like looking around going, there's no way it's a six minute walk. So I really wanted to come up with something for you guys, like a good storyline, symbolism, but I, I am just feeling very creatively blocked today. I don't know if I am feeling like creatively blocked because I am emotionally at rest today and I just feel very at peace. So maybe that's what I should go for today is just kind of a peaceful rainy day. It's not turbulent outside, but it's not bright and sunny outside. Yeah, I think we'll go with that. And good news, I know exactly where I am. It was about a six minute walk, so good on that. And we should arrive shortly. I need both hands. The wind is trying to take my umbrella away from me. So, both hands. All the times that knock me off my 
over here there's a lot of trees in the way a lot of not so sturdy stepping points and I'm feeling like it's very much just ocean waves there's some parasailers out here but I'm lacking inspiration and also I'm fighting with the rain getting on my dang lens and my lip gloss sticking my hair to my face luckily uh, I know that I can walk over to the marina a bit Damn, look at this. Do you see this? This not conducive to this. <laughs> and I have one hand on an umbrella, one hand on a camera. I can't get the hair out of my mouth. Needless to say, I'm not having the greatest time out here. So I'm gonna move locations to somewhere maybe less windy. This, is, this may be a 30 second clip because oh my God, I cannot handle all this hair in my mouth. Guess what I remembered to pack? Hair bands. See, I am learning. I am near downtown. I'm also near the marina. I'm just gonna try and get uh, shots of the ocean from like three different perspectives. And maybe that can be a storyline in itself. I think I bit off more than I could chew today. But you know, regardless of how it turns out, I did get out and take a walk. 
so there is that. There's construction work up ahead, so I'll talk to you guys later. I think this is gonna be the last time that I talk to you guys today. I did come up with a storyline. I'm just doing it in reverse order. I had to get out here and kind of walk around, see what I was capable of doing in the rain and try and get inspired. I'm gonna be doing a three-part storyline where I'm going to show the ocean from a city view, progressively getting closer by being in the marina and then finding an ocean spot kind of untouched, which is where we were just at. And I am trying to learn a lesson every day from doing this or have a key takeaway at the very least. And I think what I can write in my journal for today is that if you're experiencing like analysis paralysis or a creative block, there's things you can do like research cinematic vlogs online, ask ChatGPT for some ideas, look at some paintings, but also just getting out here, like even if I didn't film, getting out here would have given me some idea. So that's what I'm gonna take away from it today is if you're feeling stuck, you kinda gotta push yourself forward and give yourself a little nudge. And it turns out to be worth it regardless. And with that little lesson, I'm gonna show you guys the end result and say I will see you soon. Bye. Skate around, but I'm